Hey everybody, welcome to a, another Mail Hall episode of James's Man Cave. Haven't done one of these in a couple of weeks. It's been a little bit slow. I haven't been sending out a ton of stuff in the mail, but I did get some back. Uh, we're going to start here with a very beautiful addition to the Expos collection from Dan McGinn. Um, he played college baseball at Notre Dame and uh, was also the first, even though he's a pitcher, he was the first player in Expos history ever to hit a home run. So, fun little fact there, and he answered the Q&A. Uh, favorite team players growing up really don't have one. That's surprising. Uh, Montreal, describe Montreal's original Jerry Park, very small. Uh, what are your proudest MLB career accomplishments? Just being able to be there for five years. What are your fondest baseball memories? First home run, describe your college days at Notre Dame. Pretty good team, had four or five guys drafted, and do you think MLB will ever return to Montreal? No. Hmm. That's unfortunate. I'd like to think that the Expos will be back. Uh, but then this one was a fun addition. I uh, got uh, Tom Wright, not the cleanest autograph there, but great for the Seinfeld collection. He played uh, Mr. Morgan, who George uh, had a very, very odd and contemptuous relationship with uh, in the office and many, many funny scenes. So very happy to have him. Uh, got Marvin Bernard um, for the Giants collection. He was the last uh, player to hit a home run in Candlestick, last Giants player to hit a home run in Candlestick Park. So I love the old ballparks and I love the Bay Area. So great addition to the collection. And this one might be my favorite of this haul. Uh, I got this from Perry Sports Legends. Um, uh, Gary Gaetti, who was the 87 ALCS and World Series MVP, uh, and 87 tops, you just can't beat it. Love the old ba uh, baby blue twins uniforms, and that's just a beautiful card. Uh, and then for the Marlins collection, also from Perry Sports uh, Legends, got uh, Braden Looper. Uh, he also won a World Series in 2006 with the Cardinals, I believe. Always love the 2004 set. It's very clean, and I love the figures in the bottom left that match the players on the card. Okay, and then, last but certainly not least, got uh, Wendy Melnick, from, who played um, Marty Crane's fiance Ronnie, in Cheers. She also uh, starred alongside Betty White in uh, Hot in Cleveland, so great for the uh, sitcom collection, and very happy to have this in here. Got her with John Mahoney, the greatest, or one of the best, was also an eight man out. Uh, so everybody, thank you for tuning in. Uh, I certainly hope uh, these were you enjoyed seeing these hauls and the Q and A and the old cards and the modern and the sitcom stars. So everybody, thank you for tuning in. Have a great day and keep collecting. Bye bye.